Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I am doing a Christmas tag haul. I didn't get a whole bunch for Christmas as far as tack goes, but I thought I would just do a quick little haul. The first thing that I got was the Noble Equestrian gift tote. So it came with the tote and then some accessories and I'll show you those in a second. Starting out is the Noble Equestrian used to be the Noble Outfitters grooming tote in the, um, it's like tan and black. It has a mesh bottom, a shoulder strap that connects on both sides. It has pockets up front and on the back. And it also has this divider. It kind of goes like, you know what? I have no idea, but I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out, but it's really cool. I wanted one for so long. Next up are a few things that came in the grooming tote. First thing it came with is a belt. Um, grooming tote, gift tote is a one, it says one size fits all. This belt is large. It's not even close to fitting me. So that's really disappointing, but so I don't really know what to do with this. It's sad, but it's fine, I guess. Next up in the gift tote is this hat. It says one size, but I have a small hat. I mean, it's not bad. So that's what it looks like. So the hat is this green and blue and black stripes. It has the Noble Equestrian logo right here in like a leather. It is, it's really cute. I'm excited to wear it at the barn. Next up are some matching hand warmers. So these are super cute. They're pretty much the same pattern as the hat. So they look like that. They don't cover your fingers. They're just kind of just keep your hands warm. You can't really wear huge gloves at the barn because they get in the way with grooming and everything. So these are super cute, nice for the barn. On the wrist, it also has the leather strap with the Noble Equestrian logo. Next up are a pair of the Noble Equestrian petties. Um, they're thicker at the foot and then a thinner material along the calf. They're kind of just this like abstract horse pattern and these are also a one size fits all. I love the petties. I have a couple of pairs. So that's all for the grooming kit. Now I'm going to move on to a package that I got from Dover a couple of weeks ago. All right, so I am super excited for this package. Noble Outfitters riding tights. I got them in the color asphalt. They have, they're a knee pad, a black sock bottom. I have a pair of Noble Outfitters riding tights and I've had them for about a year and I love them. On the inside they have like a pocket for like keys or whatnot. This style is actually the balanced tight. I love these, they're so cute. And the Muse saddle pad. I got it in the Till CC. And I know I don't jump right now, but eventually I'm gonna start jumping again. They were having a really great sell on it. It was only $25. Like, where do you ever see a Lumiere for $25? Alrighty. I'm so excited. <laughs> I got it in the color teal, and of course it has the D ring straps, and it's also made out of bamboo, and it has a black inside. And then extra padding for the villa straps. And of course it's shaped very nicely to your horse's back. I have yet to use my other one, but I can already tell that I love it. I got in the size large. Anywho, so I don't know why I'm talking in an accent. I'm so sorry, I can't stop now. I don't know what color it is in dressage. Um, <laughs> I just think these are such good quality. Here's one that I bought a year ago and I never used because Legend got sick. It's like nice quality. Anyway, I paid a small fortune for this one too, but the quality difference, this one's so much nicer. Um, yeah, I just I just love Lemieux. So that's the end of this tack haul. I think I'm going to add this onto a barn vlog, so just keep watching. If you got any horse tack for Christmas, comment down below what it was. Well, I am on my way to the barn. Um, I'm going to go see Theo. I'm out of practice. I never vlog. Today, I think I'm going to work with him in his round pen, kind of praying that he's not in his stall, even though he's going to be because it's almost sundown. 
because he's been really obnoxious in his stall. But I guess I need to work with him in his stall one of these days so I don't get bit. Anywho, so we stopped at the tax store. I got a bag of treats. Um, they are the Purina Knicker Makers. So they're alfalfa treats and yeah, I just pick those up at my tax store because I haven't given him treats in weeks because I've been out of treats and I just haven't gone to the tax shops. So I'm hoping to get back on him. I keep having comments being like, when are you gonna write Theo? I don't know. <laughs> and I sat on him once since we've been on the, at this barn. I kind of want to sit on him again, but today's not that day because it's January 10th and I haven't worked with him since Christmas Eve. Hopefully I don't die today. He's just not really respecting me right now because I'm not working with him. I don't think he's in a stall. It's my lucky day. All right, so I just got to the barn. I'm gonna go grab Theo. <laughs> some more like respect because he's really lacking that right now so galloping up and down so yeah he's a sweet boy I put treats in here so it kind of looks like I have like two more Like, please give me a treat. <laughs> so it's getting late, but I really enjoyed my time at the barn today. Lunging is definitely a great way to get them focused on you and to respect you again. Comment down below. What's your favorite thing to do with your horse besides riding? You know, like lunging, bath time, grooming, whatever it is. 
And yeah, I will see y'all later. Bye.